Breaking news! We just heard this one today, didn't we? Yep. Apparently, this man is no longer a billionaire. He is now a millionaire. <laughs> yeah, he lost 350 million million dollars in a day. Wow. Wow. And because why? The 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 uh, dinner network. That's right. How long? I told you it was a bad idea. How long, me and you? Because sometimes the matches are censored. The old things are censored. The old pay per views are censored. Okay, if you try trying to tap in superstars that you want to see, it's not there. Like if you tap in Chris Benoit, no matches from Chris Benoit. Yeah. Or if you want to type in Bill Goldberg, there's less matches of Bill Goldberg or Randy Savage. But if you type in John Cena, there's like a list. Yeah. So, Vincent Kennedy McMahon Jr. lost 350 million dollars. So he's no longer a billionaire. Yep. Due to me, we'll go out of business. I thought it would be TNA. Boom. Boom. Yeah. Anyway, I'm just going to sit here and talk. Damn phones. Right, let me see. Damn phones. Hit the groupie nudge. Free juice. Get some main board. How does everybody do me today? Oh, wait. This is a camera. Ooh, what am I talking to? Like my long horn pajamas. Just sit here and entertain the fans, if we have any. <sighs> Sorry about that, people. Boy, some of this man lost three hundred fifty million dollars. Oofa. 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 Yeah, what was I saying? Don't we would go out of business if this keeps going down. If this keeps happening. They need to pull the plug on the Duty Network and release everything on DVD uncensored. And you know how much money that they that they would get? A lot. A lot of money. So they need to pull the plug on it. Don't put any PG something bullshit. Just keep it original. Keep it original, goddammit. Same thing goes to TNA. Right? Well, it's TNA's on life support. TNA is on live fucking live support. Daisy doesn't know what the fuck she's doing. Uh, if she owns a pizza place, she might get means of values. Like, I think that uh, Jeff Jarrett, uh, he's not the original thing anymore. Founder. Founder anymore. And when I heard he had his uh, resignation. Uh, AJ Styles also mentioned this. Something is wrong. Yep. Something is wrong with that company. A company that he built. A company he built. A company that people need to work harder. Yep. I think in this whole thing, it's. I think that TNA went down here when they brought in Hulk Hogan and Eric Bischoff and Rick and Rick Flair. And got rid of the six sided ring. That was the only thing different about TNA. They had a six sided ring. Now the only to see the six sided ring is the eight Destination X. That Dixie, bring back 
The six sided ring. Bring back the six sided ring. The only thing that you see the octagon wing is in the MMA UFC. That's the only place to see it. With yeah. X and X and I heard Spike TV is not going to sign a new deal with them. Yeah. Because of things he called his attitude. And you can't. No, no. They got one. One way to prove it is this house show, is this show in New York City. You got to prove it. Yeah. And I want to see in New York City that William Warren has a pay per view coming up in New York City. Right? New York City? Shut up. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. William Warren has a pay per view coming up in New York City called The War of the Worlds. Is that pay per view? Yeah. And also Global global Wars in Toronto of Wing of Honor and New Japan Pro Wrestling. I want to see it. I want to see it. It's bad because it's awesome. Wing of Honor is, is about to get up there in my book. If they only have one good match on there, I would see it. Like yeah. that match with Jay, Jay Lethal and AJ Styles. They need they need to have put something. I think AJ Styles is doing good for himself. Yeah. Because he's the leader of Bullet Club. He's also the New Japan Pro Wrestling Heavyweight Champion. And he signs not only contracts of New Japan Pro Wrestling, but also in Wake of Honor. Yeah. It's like, okay. Okay. WWE is the almighty empire. And see, but they're going down. They are slowly down and hitting teenagers going with it. While Wing of Honor is going up. Because they sign new talent every once a every once a think February month they have a capacity stake tournament or something like that for new up and coming wrestlers. Two of them impressed me one damn bit. They did. Yeah. Who was that? That Henson guy and that other guy that he's teaming oh, up with. Oh, the Viking guy. Yeah. The Henson guy? The Henson guy yeah. and that. Big men move that quick. And that other guy. Are you hearing about Kevin Kevin Steen? Nope. He might be going to WWE. I already did. Yeah. Steve first. I, but, but I don't think he, I don't think they would use the word kill Steen kill. I think he's going to say hug Steen hug. Kevin Steen needs to go back to him. No, home. Kevin Steen needs to re-sign a new contract because the way he talks... It's not gonna be P. He has to talk PG. I mean, I mean, they already got rid of the El Jericho, El Generico. Yeah. Into the attorney for Zany Zany Zane. Yeah. Whatever his fucking name was. But 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 he, but he's still pretty good. You gotta admit that he's As still an athlete. Pretty good. Yeah. He's still the same guy. But without the mask. But without the mask. But I think he was a lot famous with the mask on. Those are known as El Generico in yeah. Ring of Honor. To us, Ring of Honor. I think WWE just changes people. Changes their names. Yeah, because because you got to be like the Triple H's. You got to be like the Shawn Michaels. This got to say for both of them. Middle How fingers. This? How about this? How about this? Has been. Has been. Now it's time for a new generation, god damn it. They need to quit saying, you need to change your name, or you need to change your finisher. Because Shawn Michaels is just the only man with a super kick. That ain't this bullshit. Ain't it? I'm like, there's a lot of people use the super kick. If you say that in New Japan, Shawn, they they'll say, I kill. Whatever they say. <laughs> they'll say, I kill. I'm like, you're American with Japan wrestlers. We don't we don't give a shit what you say. And all these fans, they need to act like Japan fans. Just sit there, enjoy the match. Sit there and shut the hell up. Yeah. It ticks me off that every time a wrestler wins, yeah, you always wanted somebody like autograph this, autograph that. Or picture this or picture that. I don't wait till after the fucking show if they if they want to. Like, don't get me wrong, eighteen A. I think what they did, I think it was pretty awesome. They always take a picture and sign the guys before and after the show. 
I think, they made it. I think same thing in Ring of Honor. I think it, it is the same thing in Ring of Honor. Like, Briscoe's was in the arena. Did you know that? I was like, I know I didn't know that. <laughs> and, and it was taking pictures with everybody. Now, the only guys that has been in Ring of Honor and they had tryout matches is the Briscoe Brothers. And I don't Damn, know. don't they remind us of us. I don't know why WWE and TNA couldn't sign them. Oh, I don't know because uh they got uh, Southerners. No, because uh, they're talented. No, see, if Briscoe Brothers are watching this, I hardly doubt they do. I think the reason why they that WWE and TNA didn't sign because they are ten times better. They are ten times more athletic than their own fucking roster. I think they're they're afraid to admit that. I'm afraid that, that they're afraid to re-sign people to be like, you know what, you are 10 times better than anybody else in this whole roster. I think that, that's why they, they don't want to sign them. You know, here's what I got to say. Jay Briscoe and Mark Briscoe are better than the Wolves. And they are better than the Usos. Damn, was that be a good match though? What? The Briscoes was the Wolves was the Usos. Yeah, I pick my money on the Briscoes because because they because they don't need all these martial arts bullshit. They they don't, don't need a uh, Samoan chant or whatever that they do. <laughs> Samoan chant. Yeah. Oh, all the all the Briscoes does is go out there and fight. Is go out there, kick her ass, and the whole world's gonna be chanting man up. Well, Mark. Will be crazy. Mark will act crazy. Jay would just be like a badass. I think Mark is just crazy. I mean, Jay actually <laughs> knocked his teeth out. Yeah. <laughs> and I think we should talk about like the the people who Vince McMahon let go who should be main events. Star John Morrison, John Morrison, but 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 we're gonna talk about that in the next video. Yeah. It's a, it's gonna be called Vince McMahon screwed let, up. Vince McMahon screwed up on future stars, but not yeah. former stars. All because of Vince McMahon, John Laurinaitis, is the boy. The boy could you set my nuts. In the words of very common, you can just lick my balls. The boar can just lick my balls. Don't you mean suck my balls? Suck my chocolate balls. After I done taking a shit. It kiss my ass after I done taking a shit. Man up! <laughs>